vegan deal. It was so much fun, you guys. We ate so much food. The whole thing was dope. It was a lot of places that we wanted to try, but we didn't we get to. We gotta stand in line. Yeah, it was way too long. Like, why we gotta stand in line? We regular. We are regular. I had a lot of people approach me and speak to me and want pictures with me. But it was a lot of people where I heard as I was walking by, that's fine, Apple Vegan. Why you ain't say hi to me? I'm regular, okay? You follow me, you know who I am, say hi to me. I'm a regular, regular, schmegular woman. Like, I still have to stand in line like everybody else. Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, Brittany, aka Pineapple Vegan, and we are at Vegan Dale. Y'all already know that I had to go to Ben's Vegan because this is my favorite dish that he makes. It is his shrimp nachos with his um, spicy chorizo sausage, and he has guac on here, pico, and their homemade cheese. And y'all, this cheese is famous, so let me get in here because I'm hungry, okay? Whoa. That looks fire, y'all. About to get in there. Bomb as always. It's so good. Spicy, savory. You cannot go wrong with this. Honestly, I'll be happy if this is all that I'll get. I had some more food. So I had some mozzarella sticks from No Dough. Um, these are vegan mozzarella sticks with their marinara sauce. And I have finally, finally a hot honey chicken sandwich from Let Us Feed from California, y'all. I wish the cheese was more stringy, but they taste real good. So their cheese is 100% vegan, obviously, and gluten free. No grain, no gluten. Now let's get into this lettuce seed pot honey. I've been wanting this for so long, y'all. Y'all have no idea. I've been fantasizing about this sandwich. Oh, yeah. Oh, she's sexy. Alright, I'm about to bite it. I don't even know if I can. No. Believe the hype. Believe the hype. Oh my god. This is fire, baby. Now taste it. You gotta turn it off. I don't want them to see this. <laughs> mm. So this is a I think this is a garden patty, but the way they I think they take the breading off and season it themselves and stuff. And y'all, the flavor, you cannot even tell. Like I would think that they made the chicken themselves because it doesn't taste like garden at all. It tastes like it's a homemade chicken sandwich. Even the texture that they got, the breading is perfect. The hot honey, I thought it was gonna be super hot, but it's actually not. I would call it like a spicy honey, not hot, but it's very good. The flavor is kind of exploding your mouth. Okay, they didn't put pickle on here, but this is how the inside looks. Oh, they did put pickle on here. Ew. Ew. Pickles don't go on sandwiches and burgers. All right, you guys, so now I'm on to some desserts because I had all that savory food, spicy food. Oh, wait. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. But now we have some ice cream and a waffle from Egg Glue. So I got the Nutcracker, which is the waffle, obviously, vanilla ice cream, peanut butter, graham cracker crumbs, and banana. So, yeah, let me taste the ice cream first. Mm. It's really good. Ooh, really good. Mmm. Taste it with the waffle. It's real good. Ice cream is good any time of the year. So don't don't judge me. Mind your business. I came here to eat. 
Save the bees. Save the bees. Save the bees. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so now I have some chicken from Eat Love and they are also a California based company that we got to come down here to Houston, Texas because our vegan game in Texas is on point. Gang gang. Gang gang. Period. I've been wanting to try them for a very long time as well. So I did get their um, self love bucket which is like a little bucket with a few. A bucket of chicken? A bucket of chicken and it has fries on the bottom. So don't let it deceive you because it's not all chicken which it could be. But either way, I ain't tripping. I'm just ready to eat it. And I got some chipotle sauce. I'm a sauce girl, first of all. So don't be trying to come for me. I love sauces. My husband was hating on me behind the scenes because I had to get my sauce ready. But he gonna be using them. Now, I'm gonna try the chicken without sauce first so I can give an accurate assessment. <laughs> Cute little nugget, oh. <laughs> it was good. So it is satan and I was scared that it was gonna taste. You know how satan has like that gluteny taste. This actually does not have it. It gives me the idea of KFC a little bit. I might need to go ahead and get some to take home because they also do frozen pickup orders where you can actually buy a frozen and take it home with you and fry it or put it in the oven. Ooh, uh, sexy. Oh my god, oh my god. Yeah, oh. Look at that drip game. Mm. Bomb with the hot sauce. I'm almost certain these are the same exact fries I use. Pineapple vegan fries. <laughs> yeah, you guys, so that was Eat Love and very good. It lived up to its hype. My mouth is burning and I want to keep eating. I literally been eating all day, y'all. This is crazy. And just to speak on a little bit of the experience here, this is insanely dope. We did Texas Veggie Fair, but we didn't really get to enjoy it because we were working the entire time. We were constantly busy. So being able to actually see all these vegan vendors and all these vegans, vegetarians, and non-vegan and non-vegetarians coming and experiencing new things. But like, outside of just the food, it's like sanctuary sign-ups, clothing, body essentials, lotions. Like, this is amazing. And I can't wait to just look around some more and shop and buy some stuff. Because I'm getting full. I had some delicious food. And I know I'm going to eat a little bit more, but I really want to check out some more stuff. What? So what? Now I have um, a, I think it's a Beyond Brat, but it's from Good Food Chicago. I can't wait to try it. I love Beyond Brat, so let's go ahead and give this a try. It's so good. Mm. Whatever their secret is, keep it up, because this is bomb. We've had some bomb food today, you guys, but at the end of the day, we're from Dallas, and we have to close it out with home, and we had to go back to Bams. And you guys, I'm sorry, but this is just phenomenal. Still my number one favorite dish of all today. Everything was amazing, you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And guys, like, I'm so sorry if you weren't here. If you were here and you saw me, shout out to you. Thank you so much for all the love. And until next time, you guys, I'll see you later. I thought you signed up. There we go. Oh my god. And I'm glad you don't have to show this. I need to know the truth. No. I don't need to know everything. I'm grown. I'm grown.